Great to be here in Canberra. Uh, we're joined by our co-chairman, the Honourable Joel Fitzgibbon, and we've been having some great meetings up at Parliament House here in Canberra, mate. Well, just let me first of all warn you, Michael, about the speed cameras in Canberra. They are they are lethal. Everyone complains uh, about them. Yeah, great meetings today, particularly with uh, Defence Minister Richard Miles and Defence Industry Minister Pat Conroy. I think they uh, genuinely appreciated what we're doing, raising the profile uh, of AUKUS, that's important, and making sure particularly SMEs and people generally in regional Australia have the, the opportunity to participate uh, in AUKUS. That's, that's very critical and very important to me. So uh, good, good meetings, nice to be appreciated. Uh, and, you know, the success of AUKUS so far has been beyond my expectations, yeah. to be frank. And we're filling rooms all around the country. And uh, so later in the week, we're heading down to Geelong. And then I'll be down in Tasmania at Hobart and Launceston and Burnie. And these regional... Australian communities are really coming out to find out more about AUKUS. Yeah, well, there's a real vacuum out there. People have heard of AUKUS. Um, they see something exciting in it, the opportunities, but where do they go? Who do they ask? How do they find out how they might participate? And uh, I think we're doing, well, I don't think we're doing a great job uh, giving them that, that opportunity. Uh, local government councils uh, are excited. But what really uh, strikes me is that the people coming to us uh, some are you know, quite unsophisticated, people you wouldn't necessarily expect, and they don't expect to, be, to have a role in, in AUKUS, and that's where we can help. But some, some are higher level companies who you'd think would have a pathway uh, for both information and engagement, but are also coming to us. So uh, it makes me feel good to know we're, we're playing that important role. That's just great to have you involved and doing workshops like we did last week in Bathurst. Yeah. The whole community's coming out together to learn more about how they can get involved, how they can access defence supply chains, and you know, creating yeah. that pathway. Yeah, and and what strikes me is that you know, a lot of people think AUKUS, they think submarines, but of course Pillar 2 is much more than a submarine. So someone in IT, for example, in the regions, uh, would you know if they don't know about uh, Pillar 2, they're not thinking about engaging. Yeah. Uh, so we're not, not only energising those who have been thinking about it, we're energising those who have never thought about it. Right. Um, and if AUKUS is going to be successful, we need to mobilise every resource we have in this country, which means mobilising every individual, every company that has potentially some application and some role to play. No yeah. And as you all know, Joel, uh, being a former Defence Minister, has uh, great insights than most people here in, in Australia. So we're really uh, pleased that you can be a part of this forum. And we're certainly going right around the country now with our national workshop series. Yep. Pillar 2 coming around with cyber security and uh, quantum computing and all these things that will grow. Yep. Uh, we heard the Prime Minister say that this will be a whole of nation effort. Yep. And the Defence Minister saying it, in addition will be a whole of nation opportunity. So big opportunities for particularly family companies, SMEs to get involved. And, and what struck me today is that they're, they're as excited by the prospect of getting more of those regional SMEs involved as we are, and that's, yeah. uh, that's a good thing. Yep, no, good work, and uh, great to be here in Canberra, and we'll keep you updated as we go around the country. Yeah, and you've, you've worked me really hard today. Can I go and have a beer now? Is that okay? Let's go, let's go grab that beer. All Thanks, right. mate.